Hi, how are you? Today we are going to draw a nice scenery, a beautiful landscape. Let's see. It's like a ups and downs on the contour. So the mountain is contoured as you can see from my curved line as I am drawing here. This runs through all over the landscapes. Let's draw a straight line under these curved lines we have previously drawn. Okay. So the landscape part is done. Now we are going to draw a basic drawing of a house. We are putting the windows here. Now we are putting the doors. Alright. Let's put the roof, so much inclined, it's almost the horizontal, then we connect and make the thickness. Alright, so the primary part is done, now we are going to draw the fence, which is a little distance from the house, but it's like a walking distance, so the vertical poles we have drawn just now now we are going to draw the horizontal pole which is used as a connector between those three vertical poles let's draw another tree beside the house which is raised straight to the sky from the ground so this is done we can draw a few birds flying in the sky. So three, four, maybe another one, five. Another one we can draw here. Okay, so it looks nice. Basic shape is almost done. Now we are going to put a basic cloud shapes formations. You can see in the sky. So the cloud, it looks nice and the sun is just we're going to see the partial view of the sunshine and uh, for the shining appearance we're going to draw few straight lines which are bigger one like this and in between them or in the middle we're going to draw few shorter lines yeah this is nice okay so after this basic drawing we're going to put the colors let's put a green color for the landscapes so i'm using the crayon colors to make my drawing a colorful one all right So as you can see the landscape is done, now let's use the pencil colors to make the details of the pens as you can see which is on top of the landscape. So let's do color for three of the poles which are vertical to the landscape and again we are going to draw the connectors. Let's put colors on the bars, same pattern and uh, we are going to put the orange color for the sun as you can see here. This is just picking on the other side of the clouds. If the windows are made with glasses, then we are going to put the blue color for the windows and the doors as you can see because of the reflections of the skies fallen on the glass panel. We can see the same type of reflections here. So this is going to be blue and uh, for the roof, 
let's see we're going to use this color it's like a dark yellow all right all these colors are very basic so for the uh, side panel we're going to use another darker tone okay so this is a little variation from the top one and uh, definitely this is a uh, special color which is different from the doors and the windows now for the tree we are going to put the dark green this is the trunk as you can see and for the top part we are going to put the light green so let's put it all over the circle we can do the details with the dark green as you can see here so few details is done and uh, now we are going to use the crayon colors to define the sky so it's a lot of blue let's put blue all over the canvas so so many blues here so that's how you can see that the birds are flying in the clear blue sky okay so you can see that the, as the uh, cloud it looks the white clouds so we are not putting any color on the clouds but only color on the skies and it's the blue color okay so this is almost done to define the bottom part we can put few strokes like this color it likes another types of uh, topography or the landscapes which are not green but this is also a part of the soil so it looks nice as you can see this is very easy not so complicated you can do the practice watch the instructions and the tutorials again practice at home and the drawing is going to be easy thanks for watching please subscribe the channel if you like the videos and put the bell icons on so that it doesn't you don't uh, miss any updates thanks for watching have a good day